This is spirometer. This spirometer is used for taking measurement of thickness of glass plate, glass jar, or thickness of a coin. And especially, this spirometer can be used for find radius of curvature. This is a linear scale, circular scale. There are hundred divisions. You can see. Circular scale can be rotated like this. Middle screw, tip of the middle screw. Legs, there are three legs. The zero is in the middle of the linear scale, so both sides can be measured. The smallest measurement of the spirometer is found from this equation. Usually, a linear scale segment is equal to the pitch. In this case, main scale segment is equal to one millimeter, so pitch is one millimeter. There are hundred circular scale divisions. According to this equation, least count LC equals zero point zero one millimeter. Let's see how the measurement is read. Use this equation. In this example, linear scale reading five. Number of circular scale divisions forty two. According to the formula, the reading is five point four two millimeters. First of all, we have to find the reading of zero position. For that. The spirometer place on glass plate and rotate the screw until the tip of the screw just a little touch with its image. The reading of zero position can be measured using that equation. The linear scale reading zero. Three coincident circular scale divisions. So the reading. Of zero position is zero point zero three millimeters. Let's see now how the thickness of the coin is measured. Linear scale reading one millimeter, and fifty nine circular scale divisions are coincided. According to this equation, the reading one point five nine. But the thickness of the coin is equal to the difference of final reading and reading at which the zero position of the spirometer. So I think you remember. The reading at zero position zero point zero three. So thickness of the coin is equal to one point five nine minus zero point zero three. So thickness of the coin one point five six millimeters. The radius of a curvature can be determined using a spirometer. H is the measurement of a spirometer, and B is the mean distance between two legs of a spirometer. This is how to find the mean distance between two legs.
after extensive use some spirometers are not suitable to use why waste of which a linear scale might be inclined it's better to do 2011 first structure is a question after seeing this video because most of things i explained are asked in that question